Welcome to my video on how to convert an MOV file to an AVI file so it can be uploaded to Windows Movie Maker. Let's get started. OK, now I've already uploaded an MOV file uh, for the purpose of this video. Now uh, the file is just a, a very short video of me playing the guitar. Now if I try to upload that MOV file now, it will not upload to Windows Movie Maker and the reason is that MOV files aren't compatible however there is a tip that I can show you that allows you to very easily change the MOV file to an AVI file without having to download any additional software it's really easy now you need to click on the folder icon at the bottom left of the screen then go to view then go to options then go to change folder and search options now on the new folder options window click on the view tab and then there's an option here that says hide extension for no file type so we need to untick that click apply and then click OK now once you've done that you come over to your file and you go to rename it and now you can see the file extension is there so if we just take that away and type AVI and then click enter. Now it comes up with a message saying uh, that the fi file might become unusable. Now there is a chance that the file um, when it's converted from MOV to AVI might not work again. So you'd be probably be best to uh, do a backup of the um, MOV file before trying this. But I'd say 99% of the time the encoding is going to be very similar and it will transfer through every time I've tried it so far it's worked for me so I'm gonna click on yes now I have my AVI file now I'm going to upload that AVI file so I'm going to click browse for videos click on my AVI file and the movie is preparing for your file so this might take a moment although it's a very short video so I think we'll just wait Excellent. So it's uploaded. I won't play for very long, just to sh just to prove a point. That's it. So it is working. So that's how you would very quickly convert an MOV file to an AVI file, so that it then uploads to Windows Movie Maker or whichever video editor you were using. Thanks for watching my video. I hope you found this useful. Please feel free to add a like or a comment below.